Lot number 116 is a 2008 Ford F350 Crew Cab 4x4 Dually. This unit is very long. As you can see, it's a full size truck. It's got a 6.4 liter diesel. The motor sounds great. It's a power stroke. The motor sounds great. I was looking through this truck and I realized it's better than what I expected because I did see some rust on the fenders which I'm going to show you up close which I thought it was going to have rust on the chassis I thought it was going to have but it doesn't it has little minor surface rust the body the chassis is solid I got underneath it I shot pictures from all angles and you can see them yourself look at every picture so you can see what I mean there is some rust on the fender but you can replace the fender or you can fix it you know bondo whatever you want to do it's up to you but it's mostly on the fender and on the passenger side door the driver's side has a little bit of rust on the fenders but that's it it's just the fenders the rest of the brake lines look good the suspension looks good the transmission looks good i mean the only thing i see here is dull headlights and some rust on the fenders and a little bit on the door so let me show you first the rust the motor sounds great been running for over an hour at idle nice and smooth the AC blows ice cold it's got only 97,000 original miles so the engine I'm not worried about it the headlights are dull and here's the rust that I saw earlier and I said oh my god this car must be worse you know a lot worse than what I'm showing here but this is the only rust I see here's the door Here's the fender, it's rusted through. See that rust hole? But if you look in here, it's surface rust, but I'm gonna show you the rest. It looks really good. Let me get under here. Here's a look. It's a solid truck. So let me show you the rest. I did notice a little bit of rust. This rust on the window is more important to me than the rust on the fender so this one needs to be taken care of it's a rust spot but the rest are leaves it's not rust leaves but this is a rust spot right here all right it's got the push bar in the front like i said the headlights are dull the truck has a nice posture stands up nice looks good looks mean I don't see dents or dings. I do see the shadow from the Broward Sheriff's Office decals. They were removed, but you know, they just remove them. They don't polish the truck. So you're gonna have to get somebody who details to remove that for you professionally. All right, let me show you this side. Here's the fender. Here's the rust right here on this fender, right here. See the rust, the fender is pretty bad. Also where the step is, it also has rust but that is that is the outer part of the metal which is you know sheet metal it's not the chassis or it's a suspension you look at that all the brake lines are good the transmission looks good it's solid it's solid so you have some rust but it's the body panels that's an easy fix let me show you the doors you can see there's no rust here you see in the pillars they're nice and clean no rust no rust on the door you can see all the pillars look good that's important see right here it had a light bar so it has two little holes so the interior is really nice the AC blows ice cold the dash is good, the seats are nice, no rips, no tears anywhere. The headliner is good. It has a humid smell inside, but it's nice and dry. I don't see any signs of any water penetration, but it smells like humidity. It could have been sitting for a long time. It's, this is the most important part right here, the 4x4. Extremely important, especially with a dually and a diesel. It's a good combination. The door panels look good. The back seat is nice.
the AC is blowing ice cold. Let me rev it up for you so you can hear the engine. The door panels are nice. Let me rev it up for you. Motor sounds really good. All right, let me show you the back. It has an ARE camper top, which they got rid of the tailgate. It has no tailgate because the top is the tailgate. So I'm gonna open that up for you so you can see it. The back fenders are nice. They're not beat up like most of them are. The rear bumper is nice. It's got a heavy duty hitch. Let me open this hatch for you. It's got a bedside deck which rolls out. It's got some cabinets for weapons, I guess. Truck vault. It's uh, carpeted and this is what they use to put their weapons in. That goes with the truck. Also, it's got a 2,000 watt inverter included. Can't tell you if it works. And you got the side compartments where you can stick stuff inside. Let me show you one compartment. Let me open it for you. Oops. All right. And you can put stuff in there on both sides. And uh, let me see what else I can show you. Let me get underneath so you can see the truck, how good it looks underneath. look at this side the dually the fenders are nice and pla they're, the plastic fenders are nice no cracks no rips no tears looks good let me show you the top of the truck I didn't even see this all right and the tinted window is bubbling up in the back all right that's pretty much it good luck